Меня вдохновляет прежде всего моя команда. For us, it's always a big challenge to come here because, you know, as other fashion houses, we are not based in Paris, we are based in Moscow. So we have always only five, six days to finish the whole thing in Paris. And we bring like about 15, 20 members of the team and finish everything in Paris, style the collection and do some last touches. Это девушка, которая наслаждается просто моментом, наслаждается жизнью. В ее жизни присутствуют какие-то, может быть, романтические истории. Что-то что происходит, вы знаете, что-то в воздухе. Мы взяли одну часть времени. Какие-то маскарады, балы, гуляния в... В ту пору, когда еще люди гуляли с цыганами, когда были большие платья и взяли более современную часть. Первые рейвы, панк-группы, какие-то кафешки, какие-то модные люди, которые э, были революционерами того времени. Speaking about uh... 19th century and beginning of 20th century, there were a lot of images taken from there, and we particularly loved Zinaida Yusupova because she was one of the most noble ladies in Russia. The hair and makeup is definitely inspired more by the 80s, and then there are a lot of pieces like bomber jackets, sport jackets that we resaw and made them couture and sheer and very light, and that was an interesting experiment. There are a lot of pictures by Malavin, the artist we love, and uh, basically these would be the outfits the royal family would change into for their carnival balls. And we love the color, colors of it, we love the volumes of it, and again, all these giant volumes reminded us a little bit of the 80s. Another important subject, uh, this collection is the gypsies, and so there are a lot of funny accessories actually influenced by them, like this little cute uh, cat purse, and this one has like demi precious stones all around it, and is decorated with hand embroidered shawl that we especially made, and you can see her ears are pierced. We love the idea about this. Uh, different color of lenses. That's also kind of a gypsy look or a pirate look and kind of something very punk to do. So we loved that accent. The hats were done in collaboration with uh, our favorite Stephen Jones, with whom we work many seasons. And this time it's very funny because it's a cap, but uh, it looks very 80s and very Madonna from the 80s, but at the same time, very much like a uh, Russian peasant man. Большая шляпа, которая закрывает глаза, это что-то таинственное и, ну, это женщина опять, которая ищет приключения, что-то это какая-то интрига, флирт. This 
is one of my favorite pieces. It's it was one of the most time consuming. We are the only brand who actually works with handmade lace, which is still produced according to the techniques coming from 60s and 70th century. You can see the details are just impeccable. We've collaborated with very interesting atelier from St. Petersburg, who are the only ones doing a very old technique of painting the fabrics. And uh, so here are some really naive patterns, like the cloak, the bird in a golden cage, little cat with a ribbon, the rose, and something very classical for the brand, generally speaking. And here it's also decorated with a lot of golden embroidery. This is another piece, like more modern variation, as it's like kind of a bomber jacket or a parka coat, but then done in a very delicate way. The hairstyle for this fashion show for Liana Sarjenko started from paintings of uh, Russian women from the pre-revolution era. era. Uh, they're aristocratic women, they had their hair up, sometimes with jewels in their hair, and, um, and so we're doing a modern version of that, very modern. Uh, we have pieces that hang, and then we're doing a quick top knot, um, kind of messy. After they're done, we take this spray and we and we put a little bit of blue in their hair. After it dries, um, it's subtle, but it's just a little detail. We wanted the girls to feel sort of like very sort of like rich and bohemian. Um, she's kind of like a privileged girl, so there is an attention to detail in her makeup. If we were referencing um, a particular type of makeup, I would say it would be 90s supermodels. kind of gypsy inspired. I would say it's a rope slash a dress. Very bright and flamboyant with beautiful payettes. I really like my look. It's really kind of sexy and cool. be wearing, uh, it's quite regal, a long white dress uh, done up to the collar, black boots and a black cap.
was very feminine, was very elegant, but at the same time also edgy. Такое смешение по-настоящему аристократической одежды с каким-то цыганским хулиганством. I like the mixture of a little bit of S&M, a little bit of, you know, a mysterious uh, sweet girl. Замечательный, очень красивый показ. Ульяна молодец. Эти ткани, струящиеся силуэты, мягкие, очень много эм, ламе, то, что называется, блестящие ткани. Девушки были в этот раз какие-то особенно свежие, э, молодые, с таким открытым взглядом. Это сказочно, но это... Это невозможно свежо и очень-очень сильная коллекция.